guys. I just uh, wanted to check on my Stereocratus Gigas female and it turned out she was dead. Uh, she was dead for a while, but I could tell by the smell. It uh, smelled disgusting. Um, this is left from the egg sac. It was much better and it's feeling bone dry. So this is not a good sign at all. Um, I, I am going to open it and uh, see if I can get anything out. But I guess this is a failed breeding attempt. Normally I'm a bit more careful with egg sex, but this one just doesn't feel right at all. Oh, there is some eggs, but... I don't think there's anything, there's a lot of black eggs as well. Yeah, I'm going to empty it on this and then I will uh, tell some more stories, I guess. So this is uh, what it looks like. It's uh, pretty bad. I'm going to uh, check uh, these ones under a microscope to see if there's any uh, anything alive in there, but I highly doubt it. So I just uh, put them under my microscope and there is nothing that indicates this, that this X will ever be healthy spiders because there is no, uh, uh, I don't know how to pronounce that, in, how to say that in English, but nothing indicates, uh, there, there's no legs, there's nothing. So this is, uh, this is pretty shitty, but oh well, that's nature, I guess. Um, trial and error, I guess. That's uh, how I uh, got a few successful breedings. So this one isn't, but yeah, the female uh, was a dad for, for a while, so she couldn't take care about uh, the cocoon. Uh, it's always shitty when things like this happens, but there's always a chance on new cocoons, so that's a positive thing. Yeah, well, I'm going to throw this in the garbage can and, uh, well, try to get uh, some new spiders to mate up, I guess. <laughs> well, goodbye, guys.